Hello everyone, Dr. Hanley Tejeda here. I hope you all had an excellent weekend. In the following video, I'm going to be speaking through the goals of the persuasive speech and what my expectations are as far as the prompt. Going from the informative speech to the persuasive speech, a lot of things and expectations remain the same, particularly the time frame, five to seven minutes. You don't want to exceed that time frame and you don't want to be under time. There is an old saying in public speaking and it goes like this, forgive me for preparing such a long speech, but I didn't have time to prepare a short speech. Meaning, it can often be more difficult to be short and concise and organized than it is to be long-winded and disorganized. So, meet the time frame, five to seven minutes, not too long, not too short. Extemporaneously delivered speech again, meaning practice and prepared from brief, brief notes, but not reading word for word. Early on in our textbook from Stephen E. Lucas, The Art of Public Speaking, he says that for every minute of public speaking, how much time is required? He recommends one to two hours of preparation. One to two hours. So that means in a five to seven minute speech, the minimum amount of preparation would be five to seven hours of preparation or up to, what, 10 to 14 hours of preparation. I think if you put in that kind of time in preparing yourself to give a speech, it would be very difficult to not get an excellent grade. So in this five to seven minute extemporaneously delivered speech, make and support a central claim, fact, value, policy, see Lucas 305 to 318, for the purpose of convincing an audience or calling an audience to action. Okay, so the goal of this speech should be to compel your audience to take, to start, to stop some sort of action. Whereas the goal of the informative speech was what? What was the goal of the informative speech? The goal of the informative speech was to convey information as clearly as possible. It was to think of yourself as a coach or a teacher and to clearly share information. With the persuasive speech, what you're wanting to do is you want us to do something. Persuasion is a kind of movement, right? It's getting people to move, getting people to move in terms of their thoughts, getting people to move in terms of their feelings, getting people to get up and do something, getting people to stop some sort of injustice. And that is what you want to do with this speech. So there are different kinds of informative speech. There's fact, value, and policy. If you're really going to focus on the action, this is called policy. And that can literally be a policy like casinos in Las Vegas should ban smoking. And who is enacting that policy? That would be the local government of Las Vegas, Nevada, right? Or it could also be like a personal action. I want to persuade you today to go down to Fremont Street and hold a sign and give out free hugs. Right? That would be a policy action. I want you to go vegan. And here <laughs> is my speech compelling you to do that, right? I want you to drink more water, right? Whatever it is, right? It's a policy goal. Who's doing the policy goal? Could be a government, an institution, or a person or a group of people, right? But really focus on some sort of action. So whereas with the informative speech, you were thinking of yourself as a teacher or you were conveying information in a, in a clear way, like you were training someone. With the persuasive speech, think of yourself as an advocate. Think of yourself as a politician. Think of yourself as a motivational speaker. 
What do you want us to do? And that is really what defines persuasive speaking versus informative speaking. So, five to seven minutes, contemporaneously delivered, all the same. Make and support a central claim. A central claim is just what Lucas, our, the author of our textbook, calls a thesis. What's a thesis? Again, a thesis is just one sentence about what your speech is about. A tip for central claims for persuasive speeches is that they should have the word should in them. 